All right, let's um, try and kill this big boy. I have 99 of the uh, stones. I just need to get uh, 26 more, which I should get in this. Arcane um, Aberration. Uh, Alright. It's the same fight as always. It's it does get really tiring to do, and I'm sure it's getting pretty tiring to watch as well. But if I could spice it up somehow, I would. But I can't. I suppose one way to spice it up would be to say, do it on a harder difficulty. But this is pretty reliable, and I still haven't actually watched the strategies on what to do. Don't really need to. I, I, you know, I'm doing pretty well at this so far, even without it. But still, probably just. I feel like I'm modeling it uh, through it too much. If you get me, I will have a look at that wretched servant's thing. I'm curious as to where you get it from. I presume, um, Magister's Terrace or Tempest Keep. It's the only place that'll make sense to get one from. Since I'm somewhat bored with this fight. Seriously, folks, I advise not doing this, but. Wrong one. S E R E N T. Hey. I, I think I misspelled it. Maybe. Uh, I don't remember our WR Derek Gotter. Fuck. Oh, that was annoying. Let's open this again. Uh, okay, the Eldar twins on uh, Sunwell. Interesting boss. I would have assumed it would be associated with Kale, because Kale uh, Sunstrider turns into a wretched at one stage. Plus, is the Blood Elf uh, leader, so at least at one stage. So you you know, wretched are fallen blood slash high elves, um, Blood Elf slash high elves. So you know, it makes sense. I was, I was really wondering why uh, someone in chat kept saying Wrecked has kicked. Finally figured it out. Apparently they're a rogue, I, I'm assuming, and they use the kick ability. It's an interrupt, which, um, you know, interrupts a spell or whatever. Christ, apparently um, my... Uh, this fight goes on for like 10 minutes, it seems, or over 10 minutes, because the record victory is almost halfway, like the bar is almost half full, and it says 5 minutes 20 left on it. So, this fight is, takes pretty long time. Oh, uh, wings. Ah, they also um, pop heroism again. There's various uh, different abilities that um, have the same effect as heroism, though it appears it actually is heroism. Alright. It's a very handy thing. It increases your haste by 30%, which is pretty useful, I have to say. I'm just going to focus on this till Wings and... Well, Wings is actually long over. Heroism's gone. 
Alright, where's the, um, bastard? It's gone. Good, good. I love how many free abilities I can get um, here. It's beautiful. Even, I think I have to trade, um, yeah, longer, um, her, um, Hunger Avenging Ross wings for um, for it, but still, it's beautiful. It's been it's been seriously helpful. It appears we have uh, full healers now. I don't remember when we got one. Um, I remember one went offline just before the fight, so. Uh, we went into, in, uh, I don't know why I'm stuttering. Uh, we went into the queue and they turned up at some stage. I don't know when though. Alright. Let's kill the Gorian Reaver. What's this again? Uh, exhaustion. Um, basically means you can't be buffed by heroism or anything with similar effect. Like mages have their own version, which they got in Cataclysm if memory serves. Um, I don't remember who else has their own abilities, uh, own heroism versions. Shamans cast heroism, by the way. Um, don't know who else has it. I know mages and shamans have it, but beyond that. Okay. Let's just kill the one that's meant to be focused on. Uh, record kill is in two minutes. Wonderful beat it. Though I think enemies are typically, uh, you know, are on much lower health normally. By the time it get uh, the other enemy gets back down, the the uh, boss. But still, you never know. You never know. You know, I really need to get back to playing um, Oedipus, the uh, Orc Shaman. I'm just seeing people talking about placing healing tied totems. And it's just like, I remember playing Shamans before and it, they actually found them pretty fun, so I really should get back to that. I love how, um, you know, much, ah, fuck, need to move away. What? Oh, okay, that's fine. Um, I it said a moment ago I had to get to move away, but, mm. All right, let's see, I got six, which means I only need 20 more. Yeah, 20 more. Sure, why not? Bonus loot. Uh, bonus 35 gold. Alright, let's leave. Let's see what we get. Um, let's see, um... When, uh, when we get the next thingy. 
next raid. And I've got uh, six minutes, so let's see if I can also uh, clear the mine. It's forced a habit to select the Dread Raven rather than the random favorite mount. If I switch them around, uh, that may change, like their placement. But, eh. You know, a random memory popped into my head here. Uh, I remember when I used to be leveling up like through Outlands and whatnot. I used to have uh, like a bag practically full of um, health food and water. Health food, healing, in, you know, food and water. Because I would use a ton of it, so having a whole bag full of it seemed like a good idea. Would never like be out in the field and you know need some and not have it. Nowadays, don't really need it. Like, the game has changed substantially and all that, so... Like, all the, You know, I just heal myself and... Like... That's it. Mana... Means less to me now, because... I only use it for... Flash of Light, practically. Um, I know Judgment uses it, it and Crusader Strike, but... Honestly, they don't use it in very high quantities, and it recharges quickly enough anyway. So, unless I'm going up against a, you know, a big fight, I really have no need for food. The sleeper sushi is there to help when I'm farming the elites for my uh, barn. I wonder if someone didn't have a barn, but went on a trapping spree with people, would they also get the trapped animals? It would be very cool if they could. Would encourage people to, you know, do that. Like, say, if they're planning on getting the barn at a later stage, then they would have a ton of items already ready. But I honestly don't see the game being that generous, if you get me. Okay, I got four uh, Ogre Archaeology Fragments. That's something, I suppose. Uh, da, 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 da. Don't have enough. Much uh, for the Ogres, I need 200, annoyingly. That was weird. If you didn't notice there, um, you can either rewind a little, or just listen to me. That worker just, like, st couldn't, like, realize, hmm, maybe I should walk around the box. No, I'll just glitch through it. Okay, I have a few seconds. I can mine a few things. Okay, it's Walled City. That's, uh, not a bad one. Three bosses and... Also completes a quest for me. Uh, you know, the one where I have to kill these... Fungal giant at the end? Yeah. You know, I'm really glad all the fucked up things in this expansion weren't in Outlands. Because, you know, say... The spores possessing people and all that, taking over their minds. These were creeping me out as, you know, younger. It does a pretty good job now. So, yeah. Wouldn't, wouldn't have been a fan of it when I was a bit younger. Lift's just going up now. Ooh. I wonder what your swords are. Twin Blade of the Phoenix. Certainly seems cool. Huh. Seems they lift some of the restrictions on transmogrification. Like, um, the person has two maces and they uh, transmog them to look like swords. And I think that helmet they have on now, a hooded Malphic. Malphic. Hmm. For a moment I thought it was um, something from like AQ. 
just it looks a little insecty, but I doubt it. Damn, this person is well geared. They're in a heroic um, and um, mythic year. Shards of nothing. 685. Oh, damn. Seriously, like, well done. Fuck yeah. Spellbound Sodium Bands of the King Tor. That is a beautiful ring. 690 item level. Cargat's last link. Damn. That's beautiful. Oh, it's the first time the boss ever actually moved away from the door. And lead him right back. Uh, probably for the best. I would say if the boss is in here, we don't really want them in the middle of the group. And now it's lagging all to hell. May have to disable a few mods after this one. Daily quests have reset. Hopefully the uh, my computer will stop shitting itself. Hopefully, though I don't bet on it. Actually, I'd... yeah, the person here. I think they're in the last group. It's just kind of cool seeing the same people I pugged with again and again. Just, you know, small world kind of thing. <laughs> I know the Sorcerer King is just standing outside. Oh, and, um, Grimash is there. Uh, Grom, for those who don't know, that's his full name, Grimash. I just prefer to remember Grom. It's easier. Someone's making a lot of Drainic Stamina Potions. So it sounds like they'll have a busy night. Uh-huh. That, that was terrible. Okay, heroism. I wonder will I ever get flung into the audience? Come on. I know it may seem silly, but it just... It, the, I, the enemy always seems to avoid me. Just like considering how many times I've run this and not been picked. 